Alright, so today is uh, July 20th, 2013. It's day 46 of the 2013 Journey of Hope North Route. I'm here with Alberto Manati and Kyle Marpus Marby. And uh, today we did some riding from my hometown of Rockford into the Brookfield, Milwaukee uh, area, Waukesha, Waukesha area. Yeah, it was, yeah. I think we were actually in Brookfield, but we went to Milwaukee and we were in Waukesha and we were just all over the place. Um, the ride was 95 miles. It was long and boring, but Marpy made it fun because he does that. Alberto made it fun too. We had, a, we had a lot of talks. Uh, with a long ride, you got to keep talking to stay entertained. So we had a lot of good talks. Yep. Talked to him his life story. I told him my life story. I think Alberta we, we learned a little about, bit about Alberto. Oh, we have some people. Sorry, oh, we have some people. Oh, it's okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. We're just, we're just talking to ourselves. It happens. So, um, where did, let's see. We, yeah, so we got to the Milwaukee, Brookfield, Waukesha area. And we checked into our lodging, which was the Brookfield Emanuel Lutheran Church. Hi, Spencer. Well, I was going to try to see if I can do it. What are you doing? Oh. I can see if you, like, watching. bend over, you could like, get your face in the shot upside down. Can you bend over? Oh, hey. there he is. Hey. Spencer. Spencer. Okay. I hope everyone that's following this is uh, doing well. I love these guys. Thanks, Spencer. It's never a dull moment. Never a dull moment ever. Oh yeah, hearts, hearts for Spencer. Oh. Um, Get him. <laughs> jump over it! Jump over it! <gasps> oh no, you were caught. Yeah. Ah. Just Sorry. A bit. Um, so we got into our, our church area thing. We uh, we got some awesome goodies when we got there. We got some chocolate milk, man. Uh, mm. Like they got us. We went. We drank. Up. We drank seven gallons of chocolate milk in like one sitting. So we know how to we know how to drink some chocolate milk, guys. Uh, we also had cheese and stuff, and then we got introduced to Kathy, who is our, I guess, our, she was our sponsor. She was our sponsor, pretty, and pretty she much for the plan. entire week. Yeah, she planned pretty much everything. Yeah, we had so much stuff planned uh, for us. Well, we do have so much stuff planned for us. We uh, we went out. With our first our first port of call was uh, the local mall, the Mayfair Mall. Uh, and we were, uh, given children, <laughs> I don't know how else to say that, we were put with, uh, these the girls, uh, and we took them on, like, a shopping spree, kind of, like, we took them shopping. Um, so tell us, tell the internet about your experience and who you went with. I don't, I don't think I was in the same group with well, either of you, so. Me and Alberto were in the same group. Oh, well, there you go, I'll just um, sit back. We here. had a girl named Andy. And um, she was really cool. Um, Alberto can tell more uh, our story, though. Yeah. I don't want to so, so Andy was, um, she's a senior in high school. And um, she, as she said to us, she's not really a girly girl. So we went into sporting good shops and, um, you know, just kind of ran around. We went to Yankee Candle for a while because, you know, we love the smell of two by four uh, candles. And oh, a candle. It's a girl candle? No, two by four, like the wood. The wood? The there's candle. a candle that smells like two by fours? Yeah, there's yeah. a real candle. Wow. They have some interesting candles. Like candles mowing stuff. the lawn, and it smells just like mowing the lawn, even with that little hint of gasoline and everything. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah. You gotta check out Yankee Candle. I guess. A little plug yeah. for Yankee Candle. Yeah. Um, sponsor us, Yankee Candle. <laughs> that would be sweet. Yeah, it would would make our so band smell beautiful. <laughs> our, yeah. The van with all the food wouldn't smell so bad. We, um, I'll say our van now has a peach air freshener because our driver is nicknamed Princess Peach. That's awesome. Yeah. So, um, so I mean, what else did you guys do? Anything? We yeah. went to, uh, we went to the store called Forever 21 Ooh. and, uh, one of our teammates, Derek. Was that Derek? <laughs> tried on a ridiculous outfit. Um, if Doug could plug a picture in this video, I that would be might sweet. be able to find the picture and throw yeah. it in there. Yeah. I could send it to you if you need it. But I, it's on the group. Me, I could probably download it. It was hilarious. Yeah, I mean, so, it's, uh, uh, it was. Yeah, it's him in like these ridiculously short. Uh, they just short shorts. Do they have a yeah. name or? 
No, just okay. jean shorts, really, really short. Like girls' and, um, shorts. On the back, there was a nice like American flag on the buttocks. Yep. And, and then, then in the front, he wore this like kitten shirt. Yeah. It had a giant cat on the front with no sleeves. Yeah. So you could see his tan lines real good. It uh, definitely showed off the lines. Um, so I we I hung out with two people. Uh, I think the first girl's name was it was either Sharon or Shannon. Shannon, I think that was Shannon. Her? Shannon. Shannon. Uh, and we went into. She she was like, "All right, I'm taking you guys somewhere." And we're like, "Where are you taking us?" She's like, "I can't tell you." In my mind, I'm like, "Okay, it's got to be Victoria's Secret." Because that's, 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 in my experience, that's what it was. Anytime I was hanging, I was like, oh, we're going to, I hate Victoria's Secret. Just because I always feel uncomfortable in there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so she took us to Victoria's Secret. Um, and, um, well, she took us to Victoria's Secret because she thought it was the pink, but it wasn't. So then we went to Pink, which is owned by Victoria's Secret or their line or something. She wanted uh, perfume. She wanted pink perfume. So, um, and actually it was funny because uh, I was with Sanjeev, and Sanjeev bought a, a water bottle, a pink water bottle for his girlfriend that he was going to ship back. So he was carrying around this pink Victoria's Secret bag all day, which matched Shannon, so it was kind of funny. Uh, and then we got split up because we had another uh, girl that came by, so we got hung out, we hung out with Shakira. Uh, Shakira was this little, little girl. She didn't talk very much at all. Uh, we just kind of... Took her around, we took her, we were going to get her a makeover in Macy's, but we thought we ran out of time, and then we realized we had more time, so we went into, uh, we we went into Claire's originally, we got her a tutu, a pink tutu, because she really liked pink, and then we took her into Sephora, because apparently Kyle knew that Sephora was a makeup store, I didn't, nobody else did, but not not this Kyle, the other Kyle. I um, do know that though. But you know, oh, you know that, okay, I, I guess I don't. I have a sister. Okay. Which um so we took her into Sephora, and the manager of Sephora uh, agreed to let them kind of give her a makeup makeover, which is kind of cool. So she got her pink glitter and stuff, and she, she really liked it. So And her mom thought it was really cute. So so we did that at the mall, and then we had, I had five guys. What did you guys have for dinner? So um, pizza place. Pizza place? Called like Rocco's Pizza or something. Yeah. Uh, I'm not really sure what Rocky Rococo pizza something. Yeah, that's correct. Right on the money. Yeah. Bingo. Yeah, I, I remember that because I thought it was a weird name. What did you have? Oh, uh, same thing. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, and then after that, we came back and what did we do between then and it was that all we did for, that was our dinner, right? Yeah. So what did we do that night? Was that ice cream and chilled? I think you went out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. For some reason, I think I, we did. We thought something we did something else that night. Mm-hmm. Uh, we had a small circle up, and then we were dismissed. It was custard, and... We had, we had custard? Yeah, we did. I didn't get no custard. Yeah, you were probably in the gym uh, when they announced it. They kind of announced it in the hallway, yeah. It was really good. Strawberry chocolate. Shut up. You, Shut live, you live and you learn. I, I guess, learn. I guess. So, there's always next gym. Yeah. You do a Jamie's again and go back for the custard. Yeah. That's Just for the custard. Just for the custard. So I'll see ride, you next it, ride across the country to get custard. That's that's it sounds like a like a uh, smoking the bandit type of thing, you know. Um <laughs> all right, so I guess this was then day 46 of uh the journey of Hope North route. You can follow blogs over here on this side. They're over here. Uh I believe Marpy has a blog, right? Right? I think it's yeah. uh Marpy J O H dot wordpress.com there's a link over here and I, you have a little blog right yeah, yeah. it's al Minacci, uh j-o-h at blog you probably com. should spell that because there's no way uh, they can click the link can't they? yeah that's true they can just click the link so so yeah uh, so thank you for watching uh, my blog is j-o-h.theotherbrew.com I should have said that that's where all the links are over here so go there you can also follow the tracking app and watch us every day um, you know watch the little dot go across the country and uh, yeah, so thanks for hanging out with me, guys, and uh, thanks for uh, thanks for watching. Peace. Okay. Thank you, guys. Peace. Poop time. Poop.